And I'm standing with Scott Peters, a couple of northern boys that have gotten out of the snow for the week, come down here, do some demonstrations. Uh, Construction Robotics has got some really cool stuff out here, things that make our life so much easier in the trades. Scott, coming out of the north, you guys are headquartered up in upstate New York. Tell us a little bit about your product. What do we got going on today? Yeah, no, thanks, thanks very much. We appreciate the opportunity to be here. Uh, part of this amazing event. Uh, we're out here demonstrating uh, SAM as we have been for the last few years. SAM is our brick laying robot uh, and it's out there uh, laying bricks every day helping masonry companies uh, achieve more profitability and get more bricks in the wall and ultimately helping the masonry industry. Uh, we've got over a million bricks in the wall laid with SAM but what's exciting for us this year is that we're introducing Mule. Well, before we get to the Mule, if we're able to scan over here, take a look. I know we're on the back side of it. We'll try to get a better cut of it later, but Sam is sitting right over there. A little bit different demonstration for Sam on how that's, that automation goes, but you do want to concentrate here on this topic for the Mule yeah. because it's really exciting, it's really cool, and what's it going to do for us? It is. So, you know, we've, we've uh, been working in the masonry industry for a number of years and listened to a lot of feedback, and uh, what we've developed here is a lift assist machine that's really designed to take the weight off the mason's back. It's to help uh, increase productivity on laying block and help with fatigue. Uh, ultimately, this machine can lift up to 135 pounds and make it weightless. So now, lifting up over rebar with 12 inch block is no more stress on your shoulders. Do you, do you think they were buying my earlier segment when I, when I was lifting it with one hand? Do you think they all bought it? They thought I was really strong? <laughs> I don't know, you're a pretty tough guy, so. <laughs> Yeah, but no, this machine is uh, its real and it's, a, it's an exciting technology to be uh, playing with. I think it's really going to help, help change the game for uh, block lane. So if we want to give a little demo, I'm going to let our mason here uh, lay a block. What, what's your mason's name? Dan. So this Dan is going to take control of this here and he gives us a little segue on how this thing operates. Dan, is that saving your shoulders when you're lifting up over the rebar there? Nice and easy. Um, how about going back to Sam here, give another little plug to that, and what is that gonna do for the future of masonry? Yeah, ultimately, Sam is really, it's there to help the masonry industry. I think that we look at, uh, we look at this as a tool for the industry to help attract young people in the industry, extend work-life careers, and help masonry compete on, uh, with other, other uh, materials out there. So, um, you know, the idea of digital design coupled with robotic placement is really where the future of this industry needs to go and can really differentiate masonry to a greater extent than, it, you know, even accentuate the, the beauty and the capabilities of what masonry brings to the table. That's fantastic. This is the future right here. Take a look at it. Robotics.